Once again, we're here with Manuel Abud. Manuel, introduce yourself, please. Hola, Mark. Uh, Manuel Abud from Miami. I'm a president and CEO of Azteca America. Hola. Mon I was going to say mon plaisir, but that's my French coming out now. Uh, <laughs> so we know a lot of people are influenced by someone in their life. Has there been one or two people that have been major influencers on, on your career and your life? Sure. I mean, uh, you know, my dad uh, was always kind of leading by example in terms of, you know, he probably never put together these phrases, uh, but, um, you know, something that I that I believe in is, you know, never compromise on, on, on who you are and your values on your on your character. Mm -hmm. and, and again, he probably never put it like that, uh, but he always, you know, show me, um, you know, great work ethics, uh, honesty, uh, you know, on you know, uncompromisable, uh, always, you know, very, uh, very honest and uh, integrity, I mean, at, uh, at, at the highest level. So I do believe in this thing, in those things. And it was, you know, from from my dad, from from his mother, my grandmother was a great influence. Um, she was uh, she was an immigrant to Mexico uh, from from Lebanon. And, uh, and now that I'm an immigrant here in this country, I can I can totally see uh, how hard it must have been for her to raise her kids uh, with no, you know, education and uh, and with no resources. Yeah. So um, those, those two are definitely hand least. Now, in terms of of the business, um, you know, Emilio Escarraga Vidalreta, the founder, uh, well, actually the, uh, the the dad, the, the father of of. of Televisa's current CEO, uh, he knew the business very well, and he was very committed to uh, to to make an impact on 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 the audience that he served. So uh, he was definitely an influence, and um, and I, and I really admire leaders that can you know combine you know tough business approach, but then also social sense you know sensitivity. And, um, you know, Ricardo Salinas is definitely also an example of that. He's, he's a tough business person, but also he's uh, big on, um, you know, charity and, uh, and making an impact on society. Sounds like someone that we could use running for election somewhere. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Thanks exactly. for sharing that. That was great. Appreciate it. My pleasure.